guys, my name is Kim Prince, and of course, I am back again. And you know what we do right here today. We're gonna talk about Rayma and Asheke, bro. <laughs> As it stands right now, or let me say like this um, take it or leave it. Nigerians are far, far gone when it comes to music in Africa, and there's no doubt about that one, Charlie. They are doing well. Like you woke up to see Nigerian artists filling walls and arena performing or playing what big big shows out there, topping music charts across the globe, um, making sure that they represent themselves wherever they go. Yo, it's crazy. And you know, because of their influence on Afrobeat, um, people outside they really want to come to Africa. We've seen a lot of artists, foreign artists coming to um Africa, I mean Nigeria and Ghana to be precise. Or in the name of what Afrobeats, whenever they are working on what an Afrobeat album, they want to come to Africa and what feature or work with Afrobeat artists, especially in what in Nigeria, and it's really awesome. Nigerians are doing very well for themselves, for 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 the country, and for Africa. Idebab. All right. Now talking about Ashek and Rayma, get to know that they are about to shut down the O2 Arena. Did you hear that? They are about to headline their own concert at the O2 Arena in London and bro, it's gonna be crazy. They are not gonna do it together. Maybe with how I sounded, you might probably think they are doing it together. They are not doing it together. Uh, Ashaka is gonna do his before Rayma. But before I continue, you know one thing I love about Nigerian artists, like, you know, um, I like the way Mana, they really wanna accept big challenges. When I say big challenges, I mean, it's not easy as an artist to do your own concerts at these big, big arenas in the world. It takes the likes of Bernard Boy, Westgate, Davido, and other African giants to do this. But Nigerian artist, irrespective of who he is, no, bro, he wants to do this. Like, he really want to perform at these big arenas. Whether he's been in the game for decades plus or few years, he wants to do this. He wants to host his own shows just to prove the world that he got this. I understand there are teams behind them, yeah, who are really ready to like project them out there. But let's be very fair and honest. They are doing very well. They are doing very well. Talking about Rima, Rima just blew a couple of years ago and he's doing the O2 arena. We've, we've had or we still have a lot of big artists in the, in the world that, yo, they are finding it difficult to do it. I, we don't know the reason why, but... They are yet to do it, but Rima is doing it and Asheke. He the Bob. So let me quickly let you know um, that Asheke will be doing his on the 20th August 2023. 20th August 2023. And Rima will be doing his on the 14th November 2023. The same venue at the O2 Arena in London. We can't wait. Yes, we can't wait. We, we understand that they've been performing big, big shows out there, but be able to sell out the arena is really going to be one of the world's greatest achievements in their lives. And yes, it's a fact. It's about, you know, O2 Arena is one of the biggest arenas in the world where every artist would love to perform. Yes, every artist would love to be there to perform. But you know what? I keep on asking myself these questions all the time. Yes. I know this question, some of you might really get it twisted or you, you, you're going on. I don't know, but yo, I'm asking this harmless question. When is Ghanaian artists going to do this? Like going to, yes, do their concerts at the O2 Arena or something. Yeah, we've never seen this happening, but we know and believe that it's going to be happening very, very soon. Yes, it's, I, I, I see this happening. One day we'll go to Nob, they say, oh, um, Shatawali is doing the O2 Arena. Um, I know that we can actually say, because they've never hosted their own shows at the O2 Arena, it doesn't really guarantee that they are not doing well. Yes. Though they have not done that before, they've never held their concert at the O2 Arena, but still, they are doing an amazing job. Yes, they are feeling arenas, they are performing shows out there. But the question is, when are they? Because we really want to see this for real. We really want to like wake up and see that yo, yeah, garden artists are doing this. It's possible, you know, that it's really, really possible. <laughs> All right, so I'm that said, get to know that Asheke and Rima will be shutting down the O2 Arena 
this year and it's going to be crazy we can't actually wait you know talking about nigerian we've only seen whiskey david obrena boy doing this but we've never seen other artists doing it and yeah like i said they are doing very well for for themselves for for, for their country and for africa and we are proud yes they are, we are proud because of them people are loving afrobeat like yes people outside there foreign artists are coming to africa it's crazy it's just very crazy recently we saw ronaldo jamming to Remy's song and um this guy what's the name um van dizzy also said that his favorite song is Remy's calm down like yo they are um loving afrobeat and we love to see all these things happening but all right so that's it this is what i for you about Rima and asheke my name is kim prince and i told you this channel is the right place for you when it comes to entertainment so you know what subscribe to the channel and stay updated i'm gonna be back again bye bye